What is going on guys, it's Waffa here, and welcome to Destroy All Humans, One Giant Step on Mankind. <laughs> now this is a remake of Destroy All Humans from like the PS2 era, and basically you're, a, you're an alien invading Earth, that's really all I'll say about it right now, because we're about to jump right into it, and the game's going to kind of explain itself, I'm sure, so let's just jump into it, and let's start the Destroy All Humans remake. Humans of planet Earth, be advised. While the experience has been upgraded, the content and historical record of the original invasion of the Furons remains a near-identical clone. The story, words, and images contained within may be shocking to the modern human brain. Hello, friends. Have you ever gazed up into the night sky and wondered at the possibility of life on other planets? What marvelous beings might exist out there, hands extended in friendship, awaiting the moment when we humans take our first tentative steps into space? What tales will be told of that glorious day when we are first contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars? All systems go, General. Four. Come on, baby, show us what you got. Three. What the hell? Two. What in the blue blazes is that? One. No, wait, stop the countdown. A crash spaceship. In a desert. Could this be Roswell? Incompetent fool. I should never have sent you. What's shaking, Pox? You look a little, what's the word? Constipated. <sighs> Let's just say I hope you turn out to be less of an evolutionary dead end than your predecessor. You lost me. Shall I tell you a secret? Few of our people know this. But the DNA patterns in our cloning banks are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. But I lost contact. Let me get this straight. You sent me, uh, him. Crypto-136 to a hostile planet, and he's disappeared. Maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie. But there's a time for thought, and there's a time for action. And this is one of those times. Which? The second one. Perhaps you're right, 137. Of course I'm right. You kidding me? A cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys? We gotta go in. We gotta crack some craniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta... I gotta... Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? Patience, Crypto. Patience. I take your point. Prepare the mothership. That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy planet? Our destination. The planet Earth. <gasps> That's such a dumb name. 
Like, Earth means dirt, right? Why would you name a place after dirt? <laughs> And here we are, you guys. We're going to be starting the first mission here. Now, some of this may seem familiar for some of you guys because I played the demo of this game about a month or so ago. And, uh, well, that was basically just the first mission. So we're going to be doing that same first mission here at Destination Earth. And then we're going to be playing the second mission after that. So that's going to be fun. But for right now, let's just start this first mission, Destination Earth. And there's Crypto with the spaceship coming out of the mothership and heading straight to Earth. Destination Earth! When it fits the situation, override the active hollow bob dis- I don't know what else it said. <laughs> Blue Moon Drive-In Cinema. Now playing. Playing 42 from outer space. Box to Cryptosporidium 137. Come in, Cryptosporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto! To ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovoids are likely candidates. Surely you don't mean those foul-smelling gas bags beyond the fence. Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. Now, Cryptosporidium! Alright, well it's time to greet the dominant species of Earth, these cows. And Crypto! Do verify your suit is working under Earth's atmospheric conditions. Get a move on! Yeah, we got these cows over here. Let's start scanning these disgusting cows. We can peer into the minds of lower life forms via the cortex scan. Rip the preliterate thoughts from their pathetic little brains! Alright, let's mind read this cow. Moo? Primitive, yet profound. Scan another one. <laughs> Just jumping around in a big puddle of poop. Let's scan another cow. Again with the moo? I think these lactating bovoids are trying to fool us. Uh oh. You're not fooling me, cows. They eat with their mouths. Ugh. I think I'm going to be violently ill. Attention, Earth creatures. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. At this time, we wish to abduct you for the purpose of scientific research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? Earth creature, I am addressing you. Respond or be vaporized. Oh, God. I don't care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. We Furons have evolved the astounding power of psychokinesis, Crypto. Target an object or creature, then lift it into the sky. Use PK to finish off the belligerent bovines. Slam them into the ground! Oh! Oh my gosh! Creatures. Throw it towards the house! It landed on the roof! Oh my gosh! Where else can I throw this guy? Throw it towards the barn! Oh, 
Oh, it didn't. Oh, I hit the barn there. That's good. All right, I slam this one on the ground. Actually, you know what? Let's slam it into this. Oh! Good work, oh. Crypto. <laughs> Jeez. Mmm, Martha. You didn't tell me we was having barbecue for dinner. Wait a minute. That ain't steak. That's holy mother. Martha, give me the shotgun. This looks like a job for the Zapomatic. Fry that farmer. All right, let's fry him. Extract and collect the brainstem from what's left of the agricultural engineer. All right, extract the brainstem from. The, well, he. I uh, doubt he has too much brains. You can consume the brainstem and collect the furon DNA. Mmm, delicious. Harold, come on back. You gotta see this. They got a talking horse on the TV. I ain't never seen nothing like. I am not green. Shields. As long as shields have energy, they protect you from harm. A gauge showing the current charge appears when the shield isn't fully charged. When you get hit or touch water, shield energy depletes. Some impacts deal more damage than others. If not damaged further, the shield slowly recharges after a few seconds. The shield bar turns red when it's out of energy. Any hit could be lethal. Dodge projectiles or retreat from battle until shields begin recharging. Collecting brain stems reduces the shield recharge delay. The saucer also has a shield. To recharge, use its drain ability on humans or vehicles instead. The saucer shield doesn't recharge automatically. Be merciless! Let none survive! Alright, let's hit this guy with the Zapomatic. Yeah, you have to be pretty. Yeah, somewhat close to these guys. Let's go grab this guy and throw him at another guy. Let's see. Oh, nice! I actually got. <laughs> Is he still? He's still. Oh wait, what in the world? I got like a, a two by four or something there. Hold on, let's get this barrel. Oh wait, that guy's still alive. Oh my gosh, hold on. I just want to throw this at these guys. Hold on. They have to. Oh, there we go. Yeah, they don't die from that either. Let me just get him with the zabomatic. Get him with the zabomatic. And oh wait, he's still alive. How's he still alive? Oh man, my shields are getting hit right now though. Hold on, we we got to extract some brains. Let me get the. There we go. Got him. Oh, I can't extract his brains. Okay, whatever. Maybe he doesn't have brains. Oh, the police are here. Evening, Ms. Turnip Seed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. Little green spaceman! What oh, is that? A new silo? Electrocuted him with a big old crypto! That human law enforcement officer is attempting an unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. If those pea brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor, they could rip a hole in the space-time continuum. Oh, we better stop them. Oh, the Furonity. Vaporize them, Crypto! Oh, nice. Jetpack enabled. Nice. Let me see if I can grab anything here. Oh, nice. Let's get the bale of hay here. There you go. And let's throw it at the police officer. Crypto, <laughs> Did I also kill the woman? No, she's still there too. Nope, no, never mind. She's dead now. Get this bicycle, throw it at the other guy. Stop right Got him. Oh, it just bounces off and he's still alive. Get him with his automatic. Get your flying saucer and annihilate everything in your path. All right, let's go. Go, go, go. Into the flying saucer we go. Take a spin in your saucer, Crypto. Get a feel for the controls and then go ahead and start shooting. Ooh. Destroy all buildings. Leave no trace. Bomb those monkeys back to the Stone Age. All right, destroy all these buildings. I destroyed the cop car right there. Let's destroy this barn over here. Perfect. Destroy the silo. There we go. What else do we have here? The house? Yep, get that. And it's gone. Oh my god, that explosion's huge. <laughs> and we have another barn over here or something. A chicken coop. Shooting crypto. Oh man, there's like three chickens over there. Could have killed them too. <laughs> Maybe they're the dominant species of the planet. Ooh, the army. Move out, man! Move, move, move! I don't know, but I've been told. I don't know, but I've been told. Joe McCarthy's good as gold. Joe McCarthy's good as gold. 
Oh, great. The human military industrial complex. We can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence. Exterminate them! Now! Open fire! Uh-oh. Crypto! I hereby give you official permission to destroy all humans! Destroy them! Oh my god. There you go. Yeah, this you can see on the bottom right, our, our death ray does have a, a bit of a charge. It has to recharge after uh, time. So I, I can't just use this constantly. <laughs> Let's kill these humans here. There we go. Any more? Oh, there's another one up here. Let's get them. Look out! There are more to the north in the bushes. Where are they? There they are. Let's get the tank. Replenish your saucer's shields by draining any human vehicle. There you go. I, j I just drained that tank and replenished some shields. That's good. There's another one over here. Let me get him with a death ray instead. There you go. There's a ta oh, there we go, there's a ta I think we're already full on shields, I don't think you have to worry about it. Let's just get him with a death ray. Let's get that human with a death ray. making a final push! Wipe them out once and for all! Let's get that tank, we got it! There's a human on the ground, another human down there. Got him. What else do we have around here? More tanks! Get the tank before it blows us up! Perfect. Got it! And a couple humans here, actually three of them. There we go. And that one's down. There's another one around. Oh, no, there's a tank. Don't get hit. Nice. Excellent work, Crypto. All right. Great job there destroying all humans. <laughs> wow, that's the aftermath there. Destroyed tanks, destroyed trucks. Did you see what I saw? You bet your sweet ass I did. What did you see? Little green man in a flying saucer wiping out the best infantry unit in the U.S. Army. Right, good. Me too. Green? Not gray? Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? It means the papers got it right for once. Get on the horn to silhouette. We've got the worst case scenario. The eggheads were actually onto something? I don't believe it. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. That's right. And I'm here to get your DNA. And nothing's gonna stop me from a hater. Man, 80% right there. Oh yeah, I remember that from the uh, tutorial. Yeah, we could have got uh, from drowning cow in a lake and kills a farmer's wife using that chicken. <laughs> Forgot about that, yeah. Alright, well let's return to the mothership, shall we? Catamutilation pandemic. Farmer disappears amidst cow abuse allegations. Nuclear bomb fallout shelter. Who is the next Miss Rockwell? Find out on page three. Yeah, I'm not reading that tabloid trash. <laughs> Let's move on to the mothership. Now then, I know what you're thinking. What can I, a lowly novice, do to help bring about the destruction of Earth and the inevitable reign of the Furon Empire? Well, I'll tell you. It was in the earliest days of the Empire we realized our species was doomed. Eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes. We could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia. Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and nubile. Sailors on a foreign planet, letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. Over the eons, we've learned to clone ourselves, but with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are increasingly unpredictable. The Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, uncorrupted, they represent the future of the Furon race. If only we can get at them. Yes, that's what this game is all about. We're going to get that DNA back. That pure Furon DNA. Welcome to my little laboratory. You may not have known this, but I flatter myself to be something of an inventor. In my spare time, I've been developing some truly impressive weapon and ability upgrades. I'd be happy to share them with you. If you've got something for me in trade, say some of that delicious DNA you've collected. Hmm? 
Yeah, I think, what do we have, like 800 DNA? I guess we can see what we could upgrade for uh, Crypto himself. We could upgrade the Zapomatic there, the Disintegration Ray, the Anal Probe, Ion Detonator, Shields, Dash, Cortex Scan, Psychokinesis, Brain Extraction. So uh, how much does this stuff actually cost? Iridium Arc Splitter, 1500 DNA there. 1000 DNA for a Fluxo Cell Capacitor increases the Zappo. Zappo Cell Battery Charge Capacity. Electric Arc chains a few additional targets. That sounds pretty good. What about the, like a disintegration ray? Oh, I don't have that yet, huh? What about the, the psychokinesis? Compensation therapy. Ooh, cortex scan. Neocortical analyzer. Yeah, th these are locked, though. I can afford them, but I can't get them because they're locked. But uh, what if we go back? and Let's go to the saucer. Can I upgrade anything over there? Or? Oh, I can. I can get the nuclear blister inducer. Increases the duration the ground burns. Ooh. Liquid nitrogen cooling increases death ray's charge capacity. That sounds good. If, I, if that's the only thing I can get, Repulsitron, Sonic Boom, seems like that might be the only thing I can get. I might as well upgrade it, guys. So let's get some liquid nitrogen cooling and we'll have some more death ray for, uh, for a ship. So that sounds good. Upgrade that for 750 DNA. We have 75 DNA left over, so that's good. All right. Well, I'd say that's fine for right now. I guess we can go back to, what is this archives over here? Ooh, Hollow Pox deck. On the Hollow Pox deck, replay missions and do other handy invasion improving activities. Review past tutorials with a Furon handbook. Skin selection, a fashion forward capsule collection with an outfit for every invasion occasion. Let's see what these are over here. Crypto 137, classic crypto, that's locked. Crypto 136, mutant. <laughs> that's like horns, pale rider. What do we have? Oh, I, I guess I only have Crypto 137. I can't get this one. Complete all optional mission goals in mission 7 to unlock this skin. At least it tells you what you have to do to unlock it. That's for mission 12. Mission 3, I can almost get this mutant and uh, complete all for mission 18. And there's that skin right there. Okay, that's interesting. Speaking of missions, let's go over to the mission selection. And we uh, have a challenge over here. Turn up seed farm or we can go to the next mission over there for Earth Women Are Delicious. Either way, I guess we'll go do this one. Let's start the mission. And then maybe later we can do that challenge and see what that's all about in Turnip Seat Farm. Crypto! I see a horde of humans up ahead, congregating at some sort of holy ground. Here's the plan. I want you to enter the fair, find a malleable human, and lead it back to your ship for... questioning. Get the picture? Alright, that sounds good. The police must not be alerted. Ooh, it sounds like some sort of sneaking mission here, you guys. The eye icon shows whether or not a human is looking at you. A blue icon shows you're still disguised or unnoticed. The alert level will not increase. The eye icon lights up when humans see an alien or alien activity. When the gauge is red, prevent the alert level from increasing by neutralizing human witnesses. And I think that's basically like a, like a Grand Theft Auto sort of thing down there, like stars, you know? So it starts out as like, just witnesses at the at the three exclamation points there, and then it goes to cops, and then army, and then it looks like men in black there. It looks like a suit and tie or something there. Or is that Majestic? That might be Majestic logo right there, you guys. You guys will uh, know about that a little bit later on. Anyways, next. The gauge turns yellow. Oh, yeah, look at this. It's just basically showing what I just explained right there. The, the gauge turns yellow if witnesses escape, activating the corresponding alert levels. The first level just increases human awareness while higher levels are more hazardous. Yeah, with like the cops and the army and stuff. During stealth missions, stay below the indicated threshold or the mission will fail. Lower the alert level by first escaping to break the line of sight and laying low or activating a hollow bob. Ooh, so I assume we disguise ourselves as a human. Crypto! That human is aware of your presence! The more people become aware of you, the more chance that those human policemen and the military will come to investigate you and take you down. All right. Seems like someone knows that we're here, so it would be up here, I guess. I think up there is the fair mission. And then, oh, yeah, 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 we, we take damage in water. We need to watch out for that. Ooh, man, we lost a lot of shields right there. But yeah, it seems like someone up there knows about us. Let's go up there, find a fitting test subject, enter the fair. Let's see, forget, reset. The mark creature's awareness by hitting X. Okay, let's go up there. Let's hit forget. Yeah, you don't remember anything there, Hater. Don't forget to disguise yourself, Crypto. Huh. You're not exactly inconspicuous. Ooh, I just took form of this guy. Ooh, okay. Use the holobob ability to take on a holographic human disguise. The target human, meanwhile, is frozen and invisible. Ooh, that's good. Scanning human brains with cortex scan regenerates holobob. 
All above will drop if it's not regularly recharged. Okay, so we're going to scan a bunch of brains to keep up our disguise. Using powerful mental abilities, weapons, or other offensive actions disrupts Hollow Bob. So it's not less. We basically have to use Hollow Bob as like a sneaking sort of thing. So that's good for this mission. Making it deplete faster and briefly revealing crypto. So let's not do that. Hollow Bob will be compromised if humans witness its activation or its disruption. Neutralize them. Use forget or escape to restore Hollow Bob. Okay, so that sounds good. Now that you're sufficiently disguised, continue using the cortex scan to maintain the illusion. You wouldn't want to lose concentration while surrounded by enemies. Hmm. Alright, yeah, see, Hollow Bob is starting to run out, it looks like, right now, so I'm going to scan some brains, shall we? I don't know if I can scan these guys because they're in cars. I guess I could try. Yeah, I can't do that. It's not letting me, so let's just hurry up here. Seems like there's a guy here looking into the back of that car spying. Scan his brain, get our hollow Man, that talking horse on TV's a hoot. Wonder how they get him to talk. Magic oats or something. Hmm, probably. Let's see what this is. We have some hostile cops here. We should probably just go around them. I don't know if I could scan it. Is that multiple? Or is it just one? It is just one. Okay, can I scan him? Go ahead. Make my day. Oh, man. Okay, let's just stay away from the cop. He's like looking at the entrance there. I scanned his brain, got my hollow thing back. As long as I act like a normal human, I'm good. What we need is the dumbest, weakest willed, most malleable human we can find. Admittedly, the competition will be fierce. You just have to scan them all. All right, let's scan these girls over here. Ooh, there it is again. That not so fresh feeling. Ew. <laughs> what was that supposed to mean? We've got tiny beds. Clearly, the best test of a viable presidential candidate is, do I want to invite him over for a barbecue? Yeah, that's a pretty good test. <laughs> oh, I wonder what my messy thinks about becoming beefsteaks in a supermarket someplace. Mmm. Steak. Hmm. I don't know who should be the candidate thus far. What did it kill her to use tofu? Oh, wait, uh, tofu? What the heck kind of thinking is that? Meat, meat! I like meat! Ew, meat? People eat? Ugh. You don't eat just, like, nutrition, like, injections or whatever I do? <laughs> Let's scan this guy here. Man, oh man, she may be the dumbest Miss Rockwell ever. And check out them cantaloupes. <laughs> God, I love America. This human seems to be onto something. Will wonders never cease. Keep scanning the humans. I'm gonna scan a cow. I'm gonna scan a chicken just for fun. <laughs> what about another one? Yeah, they all go bok bok bok. What's going on here? What are they talking about? They're talking about me, basically. What about this guy? So pig. On a spider's web? What in the world did that mean? <laughs> it's like Charlotte's web or something. Let's see, let's keep scanning people around here. Who would be a good can- Ooh, do not hit that explode button. You guys see that? I could explode that. I don't want to do that right now. I need to find a human- What about this guy? Let's scan him. Man, oh man. She may be the dumbest Miss Rockwell ever. And check out that- I'm going to get demonetized. Scan another one. God, I love America. What's this guy have to say? Well, I guess there's nothing wrong with animals peaceably organizing. After all, it is an animal farm. <laughs> Man, these references here. If only I could confess my secret love for Joe Bob. Joe Bob the chicken, that is. Damn, I love that animal. Man, I am totally getting demonetized from this. I'm feeling wild today. Maybe I'll try riding that thing bareback. Yep, this video is completely demonetized. What is this? Can I do some? Oh, I could probably just pick up that truck. Probably pick up that box and stuff. Let's just keep going around here. Keep scanning some mines. Get a good variety of different mines here scanned. Better find somewhere to sit down. I'm getting them hot flushes. That reminds me of that old one. Oh, wait, hold on. What's here? Cortex scan this guy. I want to marry Miss Rockwell, but instead I got to sit here hour after hour, day after day, watching this dying wheel go up and down, round and round, over and over again until somebody dies. Hell of a metaphor. Uh-oh, I knocked that guy's hat off. That hopefully done. Yes! Like proteins from the primordial ooze, a pattern is emerging. Scan some more human minds, Crypto! Yeah, that was a pretty good one right there. But yeah, I knocked off some guy's hat, so that kind of sucks. My hollow Bob is starting to disappear. Let's scan some more mines. 
I gotta find me a policeman, then a construction worker, and then maybe an Indian. I'd make me a barbershop quartet like no other. How about this guy? Is this like a mayor or something? Scan him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Town's doing great. Business is booming. Hope is on the way. Yada, yada, yada. Let's uh, barrel through this puppy so I can get down to the real business of governing. Making time with the delicious Miss Rockwell. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It says I have to find Miss Rockwell, scan her, is that her? It probably is, because she's on like the, the runway or whatever that is. Scan her. I'm queen! Finally, I was gonna flip my lid if Mama made me take one more slurp of cabbage soup. I want roast chicken. Mmm, chicken of the sea. Or was it by the sea? Alright, Crypto. I've analyzed all the thoughts you've collected, and I think I've isolated the perfect subject for you to... Probe and vaporize? No. Abduct and bring back to the mothership. My way's more fun. Abduct, not vaporize. Okay, but humanity ain't gonna annihilate itself, all I'm saying. Can I finish? Can I stop you? As I was saying... The newly crowned Miss Rockwell looks like a prime candidate for testing. She's envied and desired by other humans. She's highly persuadable. Best of all, she apparently has a brain the size of a peanut. <laughs> Hypnotize her and send her back to your ship for collection. Hmm, that sounds interesting. So we have another ability. Hypnotize. Implant a command on a puny human brain. Bend its will to ours. All right. Old E to hypnotize. Implant a situation-specific command in a human's brain. I want to thank all the little people, but there's no time. Gotta go! Ooh, escort Miss Rockwell posing as the mayor. How am I going to do that? I don't think I can do- I don't think I can do a hollow bob of him right now, can I? How do I do that again? X? I think so, but there's so many people there, but... If I did that, it, he exit? would become invisible, or... How would that work? Enjoy the Oh, and don't ride the mangler! It's a freaking death trap! <laughs> you know what? I'm, I'm not gonna do- Oh, wait, hold on. My Holla Bob's about to run out. Let me get some more charge. Feet is killing me! Damn! Heels! <laughs> wait! I left my purse in the tent. She's running in heels. Alright, well, let's go back to the I ship. Don't mind me, officer. the dark and mysterious woods. There's no reason to be afraid. Nothing bad ever happens to people who go into dark and mysterious woods, especially not in fairy tales or slasher films. Not that I know what those are. Nope, nothing to worry about here. I don't. My car seems bigger and rounder <laughs> and saucer shaped. Whoa, this is just like my dream. Can't wait to tell Dr. <laughs> la 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 la. La 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 And lots of wavy hair like Libera Wait a minute Where am I? This sure doesn't look like the pie eating contest Uh oh Uh oh What's happening? Oh god please no Oh oh it, it tickles <laughs> It's probing time. Oh, yeah, right there. That's the spot. Oh, that is delicious. Never fails. Hurry, Crypto! The authorities are on their way! Get in your saucer! Wreak havoc by using your saucer's abducto beam to levitate a creature or object. Ooh, abducto beam, you say? How do I do that? Do I have to be like above it or something? I, maybe. Hold on. Let's do. Oh, I just picked some. Oh, I have to just aim at it, I think. Okay. Yeah, I picked up a car right here. And let's destroy the second fair, shall we? Oh my gosh! Hold on. Is there any other thing? Oh, here we go. Here's like a box or something. Oh, destroy the stage with this box. Eh, let's find a car or something. Let's go to- yeah, let's pick up- let's pick up a tank. Throw it at the main tent. Oh my god! Why did that explode like that? 
was just a, it was just a heck of tent and it exploded like an ex huge explosion, like a bomb went off. Pick up this tank. Get two birds with one stone with this tank. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. There we go, I have to point at it. Hold on, I'm going to, I'm going to try and uh, recharge my shields with this tank. There we go. Am I, I'm just going to get it all the way up to full. And, oh, do not get hit while we're recharging. And then I'm going to pick up the tank and throw it at that. There we go. I wonder if I can get a collateral with one tank. That'd be amazing. Can I pick up this guy? I can. I pick up one individual guy. That's good. There's another guy around here somewhere looking at the minimap. Uh, oh, yeah, the police car. Did I not? I thought I picked that up already. Throw it at this. I uh, throw it at that merry-go-round. I need to throw something really good at that Ferris wheel, though. That's going to be funny. What's that? Just a guy? Yeah, I picked him up. There we go. Throw him at the stage. And he's dead. <laughs> All right, let's get the rest of this stuff with the death ray, shall we? We've already destroyed everything with like cars and tanks and stuff. Let's get everything with the death ray. Now remember, the death ray is like uh, regeneration and stuff like that is much better. Like how much I could use it or something like that is much better because we upgraded it not too long ago. Ferris wheel is down. Golly, man, that thing is huge when it falls down to the ground like that, man. And that's the whole carnival gone. Man, look at that. That is a mess. No one's going to know where Miss Rockwell went. Hey, the cows are still alive. That's all that matters, right? <laughs> mission successful. 90% mission completion. Yeah, we could have missed, uh, escorted Miss Rockwell using the mayor's, like, hollow bob or whatever, but I didn't want to really risk it. I don't know if I'd get, like, caught if I hollow bob, like, in front of people like that, you know, because... Apparently you can't, well, I don't know if you can jump from one hall about to another and be undetected. Maybe. I guess I probably could have done that. Man, well, whatever. Experimental Psylink hollow bob. Hypno blast forget. Abducto beam unlocked. New in the box lab. Neocortical analyzer compensation therapy. Cognito hazard pattern alpha. Shield enhancer pack. And 900 uh, DNA right there. Nice. All right. Disaster at Rockwell Fair. Fairground left in tatters by Freak Storm. <laughs> Yeah, that's what destroyed it, right? Mayor miraculously survives fairground disaster. Miss Rockwell committed to Shady Pine Sanitarium. <laughs> yeah, because she got abducted and she did, she's saying she got abducted by aliens and no one believes her, I bet. Uh. Oh, what? A saucer upgrade, perhaps? No? How about your gun or your abilities? Hmm? Yeah, what, we, we upgraded our saucer last time. Let, let's go to Crypto himself. Zapomatic, yeah, we could do the... Ah, oh, we still can't afford that. We have 975 DNA. We could probably redo a mission to get... Uh, oh, I could... Oh, see, I just need 25 more DNA. I probably could have gotten a ton of DNA by uh, extracting brains during that bit. But uh, whatever, not that big of a deal. Anal probe, still nothing there. And uh, what was that again? Something for the shields. Shield enhancer pack, yeah, we unlocked that for 1,000. Yeah, I can't afford anything right now. I can do the neocortical, neocortical analyzer. Increase the duration of the holobob when scan a brand new thought. That sounds good. Let's do that. Because I'm like, that's pretty much all I can afford right now, right? Composition therapy. Small levitated objects fly faster when thrown. Deal more damage and impact their target as if they were human size. Okay, so like a small box, I guess, would be as, as damaging as like a human, I guess. Or if it was like a box as big as a human. Anyways, still can't uh, afford that. And then the Zabomatic and the Fluxocell. Uh, capacitor can't afford those either all right well this is probably going to be a pretty good place to leave off for episode one you guys we did the first two missions and kind of got a hang for what this game is all about so i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you guys did be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below and i guess we'll go to the main menu for this and if you guys want more of these awesome videos be sure to hit that subscribe button that'll put my latest videos on our youtube homepage as soon as they come out because we're going to be playing some more destroy all humans this weekend so be sure to hit that subscribe button so you'll know as soon as a new video goes up so you don't miss an episode but until then thank you guys all very much for watching and i'll see you guys here next time with some more destroy all humans oh my there <laughs>